Chris from TCO Fly Shop, and today we're going to be discussing something that we're often asked here at the shop. You're going on your first flats, bonefish, and permit expedition, and you've been freshwater fishing your whole life. What do you need to bring? What's ideal for a trip like this? That's what we're going to go over today. First thing we're going to discuss, the rod and reel, very pivotal part of your fishing experience. Ideally, 9 foot 8 weight or 9 foot 9 weight is the most versatile for something like this. Four piece rods, easy for travel. A reel that has plenty of backing capacity and has a large arbor with a drag that can handle these tough running fish. 9 foot 8 weight or 9 weight. Next we'll talk about the fly line. This is very important that you get this right. Fly line must be a tropical line. The issues with temperatures on regular lines make them hard to cast. Tropical lines such as the SA Bonefish line is ideal for these situations. Next, footwear. Footwear is very critical. Spending a whole week wearing these shoes, they should be comfortable as well as protecting your feet. A lot of people like to get the soft top neoprene flats boots with the soft bottom. These may look comfortable in the shop, are not ideal for flats fishing all over the place. So what you want to do is you really want to get something with a much more support and protection for your foot, like a Sims or a Patagonia flat sneaker or boot. It's going to have a lace-up system, much more durable sole, just much better all around for in the boat, wading on coral, stingrays, things like that. Uh, this is just a much better boot for a week-long flats expedition. Leaders are pretty simple, 10 foot 10 pound and 10 foot 12 pound bonefish leaders. I would bring about one a day with tippet to match the poundage that you're using. Fly-wise, this can get very exciting. This is the fun part. We have a variety of flies here that will work for this and we'll happily help you pick ones for the correct destination. A pack to carry all this gear is important as well. You can do a waste pack such as this one. This one is a full waterproof bag. You can also choose some of the non-waterproof varieties. There's a million of these in the store and you can choose the one that best fits your needs. Finally, we'll talk about clothing. Clothing is very important. It's very hot, very sunny, and a sunburn can ruin a trip very quickly. So really focusing on the proper clothing to protect yourself where there's no shade out in the boat is important. A nice hat with a long bill helps keep the sun out of your eyes. A buff or something like a buff to go over your face to protect you from the sun on your nose and ears. And then a variety of different shirts and pants that are UV block is very important as well. We have a variety of these in the store. Thank you and hopefully this helps you get the basics for what you need for a flat fishing trip. Stop into the shop at any time, we can help you further. Bobby, 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 Bobby,